Hello there, Mikey, Mikey, Mikey here, and welcome back, finally, to another episode of Skyrim. It has been billions of years since the last episode. So long, in fact, I can barely remember what we're doing. Um, I will now be keeping a better track with these episodes. Minecraft has taken over the channel so much. Obviously, it is the most, you know, most popular channel, uh, series, sorry. Uh, so yes, I've been striving to get that done. Been very busy over the recent weeks, but yes, we should be getting back on track now with this and Final Fantasy. So, I have travelled here to, uh, Morthal, uh, and I'm in the High Moon Hall, ready to speak to the Yol, and hopefully, hopefully, it's going to be time to, uh, get us a house. We should, we're level 10 now, we should have unlocked, let's just check, yeah, level 10, we should have unlocked the ability to get a house which we desperately need. Please, you look sick. what's happened to the burned down house? Ha ha! house? He lost his wife and daughter in the blaze. My people believe it to be cursed now. Who am I to gainsay them? What does the Rogger say? Krogar blames his wife for spilling bear fat in the fire. Many folk think he set the fire himself. Oh, with his own wife and child inside? Lust can make a man do the unthinkable. The ashes were still warm when he pledged himself to Alpha. Well, that's absolutely horrific. So why haven't you arrested him? On rumor and gossip? No. But you, a stranger, might find the truth for us. Sift through the ashes that others are too fearful to touch. See what they tell you. Should you prove him guilty or innocent, I will reward you. Ah ha ha ha, laid to rest. I understand you have visions, I will leave that. Right, okay. Investigate the burn house. Surely this is uh, the quest that we wanted. So if we have a little look here. Have a look in the quest and later rest investigate the burn house. We're going to put that top quest. We're going to do this first. Uh, let's have a look at where it is on the map. Hopefully it isn't too far away. If it can be fast traveled to, uh, then I will indeed fast travel. Whoa. You there. The Dawn Guard is looking for anyone willing to fight against the growing vampire menace. What do you say? Um... Killing vampires. Where do I sign up? But isn't the... This person a vampire here, the Yarl? Um, I'll just say uh, this. Ezron's going to like you. Go talk to him at Fort Dawnguard, southeast of Riften. He'll decide if you're Dawnguard material. Oh my goodness, I forgot that I'm a vampire. <laughs> um, um, <laughs> oh goodness, yeah, you, that was the perfect timing as well. You feel thirst as the sun sets. Oh dear, we need to go and sort ourselves out. Uh, I'm probably going to have to look how to do that. But anyway, let's have a look on the map uh, where this house is. So let's go world map. Oh, it's not far away. I mean, we can sort it. I mean, is it? Do we need to do a quest for vampirism in this? I mean, we're going to do every quest sooner or later. Oh, the burned house is just here. Is this even the right quest? There's a ghost. Who's there? Is Hello? Mm -hmm. Who are you? Helgi, but father says I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Are you a stranger? I mean, uh, no, I'm a friend. The smoke woke me up. I was hot and I was scared, so I hid. Then it got cold and dark. I'm not scared anymore, but I'm lonely. Will you play with me? If I do, will you tell me who set the fire? Okay, let's play hide and seek. You find me and I'll tell you. We have to wait for nighttime, though. The other one is playing too, and she can't come out until then. The other one? What do you mean? I can't tell you. She might hear me. She's so close. If you can find me first, I can tell you. Oh, and just completely disappears. Okay, find Helgi after dark. Right, okay, so I will wait until dark, and then I will bring us back. Um... And I'll also have a little look about what I'm going to do about this being a vampire. I mean, it's nearly dark now, but yes, I will see you in a minute, guys. Guys, I was just waiting at night and now this is happening. I don't, I don't know what's happened or why I'm being attacked. There's such bad news. We're going to have to do a big old quest as well to, uh, to heal our uh, vampirism. So that's just great news. Come on, Lydia. You need to help me out here. Let's get a big attack on him. Wow, these guys are taking quite a bit of uh, quite a bit of beating, but Lydia's actually very strong. 
Oh, as I see, as she's going down. No, Lydia, get back up, Lydia. Lydia, I can't do anything on my own. I'm an idiot. Lovely. Oh, hello. Okay. Well, that was really nice. Why have we got hired thugs coming after us? Contract, that'll tell us. Oh, some nice, a nice bit of uh, gold there. That's really cool. Have you got a load of gold on you as well? 104 as well. Yes. This is most definitely fine. And where's the last one? Here. Oh, fantastic. An orcish sword? Ha, 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 ha. I might be over encumbered, but I don't care. What was I using? Oh, an orcish war axe. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, fine. Fine, we'll leave the orcish sword for the moment. Right. Okay. I hope you're not an enemy or anything. Who are you? Is everything alright? Okay, I need to speak to a bartender, apparently, about this, uh, this van prison. But anyway, let's go back to the house and see if we can see the ghost. We need to find her at night. Now, where the heck? Oh, oh well, I wouldn't expect her to be still hiding here. Be going to be around the place? We just search around. This isn't a massive town. Lydia, keep your eyes peeled. We're searching for a ghost girl. Damn shame, he's saying. Look, damn shame about the people that tried to kill me. Yeah, it's a damn shame that they're dead, isn't it? Can I jump up here? I just want to stand up here for a vantage point. Ghost? Hello? I'm not really speaking in ghost. Woo! Woo! Okay, it's not working either. <laughs> Where is she going to be? Around this way? Other side of town? I see nothing ghostly. Wait, what, was that something in the boat? No. Oh, guys, I'm rubbish at hide and seek. You know, uh, also, a story about hide and seek while we are looking for this girl is that is how I actually proposed to my fiance. It was hilarious. We went to a, uh, a beautiful um, place near me. Uh, full of you know lovely gardens and and the uh, and the likes, uh, and I went and uh, we were you know hid somewhere. She found me a bit too easy. It wasn't really a great way of doing it. So uh, <laughs> I said, um, um, yeah, let's play again. Let's go and hide. Honestly, where you know we were 25 years old. What an it oh. Hello, well done. See, she, she <laughs> all she was thinking is, what is this idiot doing at playing hide and seek at the age we are? Uh, and, uh, yeah, I, when she found me the next time, I was on one knee uh, and brought, you know, I said, I found something for you. And she's thinking, oh, my goodness, he's got a spider. He's going to chuck a spider at me. What's he got? He's got something stupid. Uh, he's going to chuck it at me. Seriously, where is this ghost girl? Um, and then, obviously, I proposed to her and it was the greatest day ever. Uh, but, yeah, it was just so funny. <laughs> she was just like, what the heck? do you think you're doing? Where? Right, okay. Is there any footprints or anything? This is a very light night time, I'll tell you that now. Anything up the, uh, up the chimney? Right, what about up here then? For goodness sake, where are you? Am I going to have to do another thing off camera? Because this is taking far too long. Right, okay. Let's go to quests. Which we can't do if we're in this map. No. It's very particular about that. Right, okay. There we go. <sighs> no. No. The quest just pretty much gives it away that it's not him that's done it, really, by saying we think he did it. So, we are going to find out something different. Right, anything up here? You'd think maybe she'd go away considering she was scared about being heard. Oh, hello. Oh, I can't be bothered to kill you. Hmm. I feel like maybe. Just maybe I'm going the wrong way. We'll go to this cave. Because that is the closest landmark that I can really see. 
So maybe it could be something to do with that. We will have a look. Let's sprint up there. Come on then. I'm nearing the cave, I think. Hopefully it's easy to get to. Come and jump. Oh no. Can't even get up here. I reckon this is completely wrong. Completely wrong. Can't get around this bit. There we go. Lovely. Are we ever going to get to this cave? It's not going to be the right cave, so... Could it possibly be? Come on. Say that I figured this out on my own. It'd be really nice to figure something out. <laughs> What's that? Just a little fox. And this is going to be the cave. Nobody here. Brood cavern. Oh, hello. We've got a dead Khajiit. Frostbite Spooner. You have been poisoned. Excellent. Lydia's nowhere to be seen because I've uh, jumped over things and she hates that. Let's have a quick heal up. Come on. Come on. What are you doing? Hi. Alright, I'll just backtrack while attacking you. Lovely. Good. Any more? Apparently so. Where is it, Lydia? Wait, what? Oh, wow. Cool. And a dragon. Yay. Great. Please, please stay away. Okay, let's have a look at this, Kaji. Two gold. Absolutely rich. Troll skull. Doesn't look like we can actually get to that spider, which is annoying. Unless... Oh, no. We can go up here. Ah, oh, Lydia's already on the case. Go on, Lydia. Wait, what? Is that you, Lydia? That's you talking. Hello, Mr. Frosty Bitey. That's it. We'll block. Hiya. Oh, no, it's jumped. You've been poisoned, but it doesn't matter. We've taken it down. Right, this is all completely not the right place to go, I reckon. I kind of want to poke my head inside the, uh, the cave just to see. What's happening? I'm stuck. Just to see if this is it, but I bet it isn't. I just bet it really isn't. Uh, wait, what? Where's the cave entrance? Well, this is just a waterfall. Is it? Was it up there? Is it below? Oh, for goodness sake. Is it up here? Lydia? Lydia. Is it here? It's here. Good, right. Okay, this could be it. Might not be it. If it's not it, I'm going to go and find it off camera because I don't want to waste your time. Ghost? Oh, ghost girl. Oh, cool. It's a spider. Oh, I've hit you, Lydia. I've hit you there, definitely have. Oh, I can see more coming. I'll take this one, you take that one. Come on, Lydia, we can do it together. Look at my dodging skills, they're amazing. Lovely. Anything on you? Uh, I'm not going to bother check them. They've just got a load of frostbite venom. What's this? Ah, oh, poor dear. Oh dear. <clears throat> um, okay. That's where we came in. Ah, hello. Little chesty chest here. We're 58 gold, which we will definitely take. What's this? What's the blue bit there, though? It's very much like a potion of some sort that we can't pick up. Okay, never mind. Never mind about the stupid potion. We've got an orcish bow here as well. Nice. Right, is there really not anything else to this cave? No. Well, that was a complete waste of time. She's not even here. Is it through here we came from? Oh! Hello with a uh, funny little skull thing. Right, okay. I still want to be a little bit further. Maybe a little bit more further. Lovely stuff. Lock picking increased. Oh, we get some lock picks from it and some gold. Okay. Let's check behind all the waterfalls just in case. Where's out as well? This is out. Lovely. Okay, that was a complete waste of time. Guys, I am going to find this ghost. And bring you back. Look at all that. That was a crazy blue. Right, yes. I'll bring you back, guys. It's happened again, guys. <laughs> every time. Every time that I go away, I uh, 
<laughs> I end up getting attacked. And this time by a vampire. As fun as that was. I'm also a vampire, so that's great. But uh, yes, I found it. I was on the right track going up the hill. It's actually uh, just here, and there's a coffin, a child's coffin, which is horrible. Whoa, Layla hello. was trying to find me too, but I'm glad you found me first. Layla was told to burn mommy and me, but she didn't want to. She wanted to play with me forever and ever. She kissed me on the neck, and I got so cold that the fire didn't what even hurt. What a waste. Layla thought she could take me and keep me, Layla. but she can't. She's dead. I'm all burned She's up. I'm tired. She's, I'm she's gonna sleep for a while now. Um, was she meant to appear? Because otherwise, that's really even. That's creepier. The fact that she was in there. She's dead. He's spear. She's, she's a vampire. Wait, what? Was that this? That wasn't the girl, was it? What? What? <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Right, quick. She's dead. Layalette is dead. Oh, okay. Layalette. I thought she left to join the Stormcloaks. Oh, my poor Layalette. Yeah, yeah, all these um, blooming vampires. <coughs> oh, I hate them. Oh, don't trust one. Uh, did you notice anything strange before she left? She began to spend a lot of time with Alva. Yet just a week before, she despised her. In fact, the night she disappeared, she was supposed to meet Alva. Alva told me later that she never showed up. I never got to tell her goodbye. Oh, and uh, she ate a lot of people as well. Yeah, that was the other thing. <laughs> I think they may have met after all. You think Alva? But that means... Ye gods! You think Alva is a vampire? No, what? what? I hate vampires. It's a possibility we can't ignore. No, you're wrong. You must be wrong. Leilet may have met her fate out in the marsh. I refuse to believe Alva had anything to do with this. There is no way you can prove it to the Jarl. I hope Alva is not what you think. Hmm, well. No way I can prove it to the Jarl, huh? Challenge accepted. Off we go. Jarl, Jarl! Although the Jarl's also a vampire. Not that it's uh, exactly, you know, a surprise. Well, at least I think he is. He looks like one. <laughs> I don't actually know this guy. It's entirely uh, just from what it seems with him. Uh, let's uh, go. Across. Wait, what? Where's he telling me to go? I'll investigate the house. Mm. That's how we'll convince him. Are we allowed in here? Oh. Being watched. No, I'm okay. Adept, quick, go. Yes, good. I'm glad that one broke. I didn't like that one. That was the worst one I ever had. I'm sorry, what? Ah. <laughs> Please. Oh, come on now. Is it back this way? Yes, yes it is. Let's go. Okay. What? Huh? What? Oh, come on now. Will you please just not? Are you meant... Am I meant to kill you? I don't know if this is good. Um, I'm going to leave and see if I've got a bounty on me. I'm very worried. It was Lydia. It was all Lydia. Guards, is everything all right? What happens if I talk to these guards? Okay, something really weird is happening. What are these guards doing? The hood. There's been another dragon attack. Pine Scroll. I used to be an adventurer like you. Then I took an arrow in the knee. Yes, yes, we've all heard that before. Um. Okay. Everything's fine. I didn't attack them. It was all Lydia. Lydia's a complete murderer, yes? As long as we're all clear. But please don't arrest her because I need her for stuff. Right, back in. Back in we go. No one needs to worry. Mortal guard. I mostly deal with petty thievery and trouble. Okay. But everything's fine. Just gonna take all this off his body. Been too long since you've had a good Oh yeah, that's yeah, it's good, mate. Anyways, I'll see you later after you've done glitching. Yeah, see you later, mate. 
Ah, it's good. I'll let her know that you uh, you, you, you dropped by. Okay then, let's uh, let's take everything forever. So we'll have this gold, all the gold. Immortal blood. Oh, it's a book. It's a book. We don't want the book. Right, okay. Steal from the chest. We'll have everything. Gold. We'll have everything later from there, actually, because we can't fit it in our pockets at the moment. Um, what else we got? We got this chest as well. With some glass and some more gold. Oh, mammoth tusks. They're worth a lot of money. It weighs five and that'll put me over encumbered. My goodness, it is so hot in this room, guys. Right, okay. Fish barrel. I wonder what that's got in it. Anyway, let's have a look in here. Black and brown meat. Wardrobe. Clothes. This bit of the wardrobe. It's the same bit of the wardrobe. We've got a loot there. That's quite good as well. Some epic loot. <laughs> Shh, please. It's not jokes like that. Have we got any uh, skill books here? Oh, something that were, was worth a little bit more. Oh, that's all right. It's not that great. Right, we've got Alva's Cellar. Now, what's going to be down here? Quick sip of beer. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, good. A coffin. That, uh, that bodes well for us. What have we got down here as well? Somebody's hand. Or something's hand. Quite a big hand. Anything at all in here. Alright, I guess we better have a look. Alva's journal. Show Alva's journal to the Yarl. Ha ha! This will confess everything. We'll take this. That'll be absolutely fine. What else do we have? Anything cool? Nightshade? Anything in the barrels? Nothing that's really great. There's not really any... Uh, chest with money in. So let's leave. Hopefully we won't get ambushed on the way out of the house. I hope everything is going to be just hunky-dory. Everyone's fine. La 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 la. Off we go. Good stuff. Good stuff. Lydia, you're a murderer. It's got nothing to do with me. We're all is well and good. Through we go. Uh, let's go into High Moon Hall. Okay. Oh. Ah, oh, he's gone to bed. No, wait. He's in here. Is this okay? Wake up! I mean, how... What? Oh, really? <laughs> I had no idea. Right, excuse me, y'all. Sorry. Is Grogar innocent or not? Alpha set the fire. She's the murderer. I'm sorry. Shall I wait till you're actually standing? Alpha set the fire. She's the murderer. I didn't think she had it in her. Actually, she's a vampire. She planned to enslave the I town. I assume you have proof. Can't go making accusations like that without proof. Wait, you're a woman? I didn't know this. I did know before, but I forgot in this episode. I have Alva's journal. So it's true. The traitorous bitch. Morthal owes you a debt. Here, you were promised a reward for solving the crime. But I need one more favor from you. Morthal is still in danger. The journal mentions Mohart, a master vampire I thought was destroyed a century ago. I'll gather together some able-bodied warriors to clean out Mohart's lair. They'll be waiting outside for you to lead them. I un oh no, that's it. We don't need to worry about that. Until yes. Next time. Lovely. Right, come on, let's go. Let's go quick. Uh oh. Oh. Take us to Mohart's lair. Take yes. us! Yeah! Kill the vampire! Oh! Kill him. Kill him. Oh, okay, we're good. cousin's out fighting dragons, and what do I get? God, guilty. Disrespect the law, and you disrespect me. I thought she was a vampire. Is she not a vampire? Oh, I don't know. I probably missed crucial, vital moments. Um, can you, can you go across water well? Are we going anyway? Are we just going? Oh, yeah, they're already going over the bridge. Okay, fine, I'll follow you! Off we go. This guy's just like, meh, I can't really be bothered. Let's go, people. Come on, quicker than that. Come on, have you not got a, sp a sprint button as well? Let's go. So, hopefully this will get us our house. Hopefully this is the right quest, actually. The thing is, I'm killing vampires when I'm a vampire myself. I, I quite like that. That's quite funny. <laughs> it's just, just complete... No one will ever suspect me. That's it. This is the way to cover up my story. No one will ever know. 
in we go to the lair. I've got no space to pick up any loot at the moment, but oh well. Come on. Right, let's see what we have here. Okay, we've got some frost spiders, which just seem to be the recurring theme of this area. Zoom through, take out the little one. The little one's down. Bigger one now. Missed him. Got a couple of hits there. Lovely. Oh, he does the jumping thing. He can't really dodge that. Lovely stuff. Any more for any more. Anything behind these spider webs? No, okay. Let's go. Let's go. Where's the rest of everybody else? Who's that? That's Lydia. Lydia's here. Where are they? I mean, I'm, I'm kind of doing this all on my own, people. Hopefully they'll turn up later. Maybe halfway through a battle or something. Hello. It's kind of good that I've already contracted the disease because I would have just got it now anyway. So, But I really should have had a cure disease potion because we have a wonderful quest ahead of us. But it is something that... Uh, you know, we wouldn't usually do and we want to do every quest in this game. So that is fine um, It's gonna be a long let's play, but if I keep you know, I need to keep up with it considering it's been such a long time without it um, Which once again, I apologize for right, let's put everything away. What's that? Oh Dear oh Dear this is very ominous. We need a, a light spell so we can actually light the place up or a torch Do we go through here anywhere? Where do we go? This is the wrong way Lydia Lydia, huh? huh? L Lydia, <laughs> I'm trapped, Lydia. Have I gone the wrong way? Do I have a torch? It'd be really cool if I had a torch right now. No, I've got no torches. I, th I think that's where they, they are kept. Right, okay, what about this way? Someone talking, but I don't know where it's from. Don't give our position away. A chew! Oh no, damn it! <laughs> Surprise attack from behind! Where are the rest of the people that are meant to be helping us? What the heck was that? What the heck was that? The shovel blocked my attack! The shovel was in the way, it completely blocked my attack. I don't even know how that happened. That was quite cool. Take the silver garnet ring. Lovely. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at the pile of bodies. These poor people. Oh, look at this. One gold. Wow, you can yeah, you can most definitely join the pile of the dead now, sir. Oh dear. Horrendous. Um What's this as well? Human skull. Wow. This is a disgusting place. We've got boots. We've got anything else cool. Hmm. What's this? Potion of stamina. Yeah, that's all right. But we'll, we'll leave it for now. What if we go over here? Nordmead. Sleep on bedroll? Do, I mean, does this matter? Maybe the people will turn up. No. Don't know where they are. They were all, all for coming. They were like, yeah, we'll definitely do it. It'll be great. I can't wait. And now they're gone. They're completely gone. It was all just a big old light. Yeah, look at all the things stolen from people as well. Wow. Okay. Apparently we go through somewhere down here. Yes, this will be the way. We will take the high road. Oh, look. An iron ore vein. Can we... You need a pickaxe. Yeah. That's the annoying thing. Aha! Look! Some more people. How do they get to us? Can they actually get to us? Ah, there's a little way down here, which I imagine is the way that they're coming. Yes, come on then. Come on then. I'll have you all, mate. Get ya. Living spell hand down. Come on then. Let's have ya. Wait, Alva? Is Alva good? Is Alva bad? I don't know what, whether Alva's good or... No, Alva's bad. Ah! Ah! Lydia! <laughs> Lydia! Help me, Lydia! Everything's terrible. I'm a vampire too! Wait, wait, what's this? These are enemies. These are all the enemies. Oh my goodness, too much damage. All the people that said they were going to help us left us. No! Oh, it's 
gone wrong, guys. It's gone really, really badly wrong. Oh, Lydia, you are useless. Have we won? Please say we won. Yes, we won. Haha, <laughs> that's not me dying for once. Great, okay. Let's search him for his three hole gold and lock pick. Great. And then vampire dust that we really don't need. Vampire armor and boots. Oh, oh guys, I want this so much. We can take the vampire boots. For now, we'll leave that here. Where's his minions, though? There are meant to be other people around here. Where the heck have they gone? And obviously, for that matter, where the heck are the people that are meant to be helping us? Huh? What? No, wait, I'm just, uh, nothing. You're down. Where's your friends? <laughs> he was down in sort of a casual sitting position. Yeah, there he is. Oh, I'll just have a sit down. There's an arrow just inside me at the moment. I'm just, uh, just trying to rest that off. Let's take all this gold. All the sick. No! <sighs> We've had enough of being over encumbered. That happens too often. Right, where was it? Iron. What was it? Oh, please say it wasn't that Iron War Axe of Sparks. It definitely was, wasn't it? No, it was It was a steel battle axe. Right, drop. Go away. Don't want you. Right. Gold, gold, gold. There's another bit of gold there. As long as we're just taking the gold, all is well. Extra bit of gold there. No, that's clothes. <sighs> okay, we can, we can take the clothes for the moment. That's not too bad. Right, okay. What else do we have here? I'm sure there should be more enemies. Is there nothing down this way? No enemies here? Hello? Ah, okay. You're who we need to speak to. So, I guess we'll get that out of the way. <laughs> Search dresser. Anything cool in the dresser? Rubbish. Absolute pants. Hello, Alva. Yes. Is that it? Is there... Need something? Cool, great, thank you, you've been really helpful. I'm just gonna go for a. S you cannot sleep while there's enemies nearby, but there aren't. There's no enemies nearby, what? Where are they then? They're around this way? There's nobody here! You annoying, annoying. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Aha! Sleepy, sleepy vampire! Slept through it all. We've killed your leader and your friends. Ha 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 ha. Take that. Take that. Silver ring. Wow. Of course I will. What's in the end table? Some rubbish. <gasps> Definitely taking that. Wonderful. Right. Okay. Um. Yes. I'm carrying too much to be able to run, but that's fine. I have some clothes to just drop. But why are that... So they, they were also... What were they? They were ridiculous price. Movath's boots. 792. Sneaking is better. That is brilliant. Let's sleep on this bed with a dead person right next to us. And some old clothes as a pillow. Look at all these different boots as well. We've got all the boots in the whole world. Leather boots, iron boots, boots. Imperial light boots, storm cloak officer boots. All the people that they've killed. Fine, but Wow. The boots of the dead. What an eerie place. Okay. I mean, do you want to talk to me now? Hi. Th yes. Okay, just go away. You are rubbish, right? <laughs> uh, okay, following this through. Oh, there's another one. Where did you come from? Where have you been? Oh, there's another one as well. Lydia! <laughs> Lydia, you understand you went to save me, don't you? Oh my goodness, I'm nearly dead. Please say that's not me dying. Oh, you ha you are actually joking me. Lydia, you are the worst. You are the absolute worst. That staggering attack is much more useful. Right, okay. Come on then, Mr. Bowman. Oh, great shot. Yeah, that's right, get your little dagger out. 
Come on then, dagger against Orcish Warax. Let's see who's going to win this battle. If it isn't me, I'm going to start trying. There we go, down you go, that's enough. Ah, oh, some gold lockpick, and we'll take the arrows of course as well. Say so weigh nothing. We've got a gold coin purse up here, 33 gold. Some more iron arrows, lovely. Anything else to take. Right, let's, uh, we've forgotten to take off this body as well. Garnet, gold, lovely. What is also in this chest? 76 gold. Lovely amounts of gold. The dresser, nothing. Book of the Daedra, rubbish. Another quick sleep. Lovely, right, okay. Ah, oh, dear, you're feeling well rested. Well, I should hope so. I don't know if I'm meant to talk to that person or not. I really haven't got a clue. We're probably just meant to leave. Ah, oh, yes, we've got a lovely little Skyrim exit here that takes us just back here. Oh, right, okay, so this is uh, this is what was actually there. Right, let's leave. And, uh, guys, I think we're going to have to wrap this episode up pretty quickly uh, because of the amount of deaths and stuff. This has taken quite a while, <laughs> for goodness sake. Uh, and then we'll complete the quest, hopefully getting our house in the next one. Where am I going? Do I go up here? Yeah, I go up here. Good. Let's leave the cave first, though, and see if those people... Oh, it's the ghost. Hello. Oh, okay. Bye. <laughs> there is definitely something wrong with this ghost. My goodness. Ah, oh, dear. I don't know what happened then. We are getting glitches all over the show. Didn't see her before. This time she just vanished as soon as I spoke to her. Didn't even let me say a single word. Oh, I heard the drawing of swords, please. This place looks dangerous. Does it? Yeah, and it's scary too. And it's full of vampires? Yeah, it's full of them. Cowards, we must kill the vampires. Yeah, go on. We have to make them pay. Of course. But why not let him go in first? <laughs> you absolute load of jokes. Right, guys, we're going to end this episode here on that bombshell. Look at them after all that. I've done it already, you fools. Uh, but yes, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy this, please leave a like and subscribe. But apart from that, I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.